Mr. Chairperson, there is only one chairperson. I hope so. I hope there is only one chairperson. Protect me from hecklers in the house, Mr. Speaker. I want to address you. Mr. Speaker, I want to address you in total silence. Let's... Just one more. I, I should be... A, Chairperson... I will, I will ask him. I have given him the point of order. Let him proceed. We we'll listen to him in silence. I'm sure before he sits down, he will make that very clear. What is your, what is your point of order? Thank you, Speaker? Chairperson, for protecting me. Number one, Mr. Speaker... I take great exception in the conduct of Senator Kajuang. If it was another senator, I would have assumed that probably he doesn't know the traditions of this house and what we do in third reading. Senator Kajuang is not only being cheeky because I watched him when he walked into the house and I could hear him clearly tell his colleagues that why are you guys not filibustering? I knew. Mr. Speaker, can you protect me? Sifuna. Mr. Speaker, let, let I am not finish. in a mood to engage yes. in a heckling debate. We will find out. Mr. Speaker, can you protect me? You are protected, Senator Chiriot. You so proceed. the point is this. Senator Kajuang knows that in third reading, you try to persuade people why you are not in supportive of the proposed amendment. In a quick, witty comment, hardly beyond a minute, Mr. Speaker, and you give opportunity to the chairperson or the person that is moving that amendment to convince you why that amendment is important. This is not a, 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 a debate stage, Mr. Speaker. Senators, Senators, let us... Sen just one moment before... Can we conclude on... Can we conclude on Senator Kajuang's issue? What's your point of order, Senator Sifuna? Chair, Chair, thank you for... Chair, I, I would like the attention of the Chair, please. Chair, I wanted to draw your attention to Standing Order 185. Mr. Chair, allow me to read. General application 